I was about to leave to go out of town to visit my parents and this just came in the mail and I wanted to open up and do a quick video because I know they are just releasing this. Now this is Holly Maker's new, why are you following me behind? This is not, this is a mess back here. Oh, for heaven's sakes. All right, this is Holly Maker's Fiberon, you're laughing, PET GF15. So first of all, what's Fiberon? It's Holly Maker's high performance composite filament. And then what's their new PET GF15? Well, that is, it's similar to PETG, but it also has 15% glass fiber by weight. And why is that meaningful? Well, Polymaker did a bunch of research and I've seen this big long document. And what they saw is that there were some limitations that PLA and PETG had. And they said, we think you can design a filament that will solve those problems and still be able to be printed easily. So that's what this filament is. So what they have is greater stiffness and dimensional stability. It has greater heat deflection, whereas PLA and PETG might soften. It resists brittle breakage. It's got better layer adhesion. And if you're going to do annealing, it boasts improved annealing results. So like I said, research galore, go check it out. But one thing I do know, even though I haven't even had a chance to open them yet, is that unlike a lot of high performance composite filaments, it's available in six colors, black, white, red, blue, and two grays. So go to polymaker.com and check it out if you're interested because it may be selling out.